Desire is about caring and affluent and powerful women who manifests her psychological issues, um, namely insecurities, um, self-hatred, and loneliness. Through sexual encounters with strangers she meets in the streets or um, online. This changes when she meets uh, Ray, a street drummer, who sort of becomes the only hope she has to have a happier life. Karen is very misunderstood. She definitely wants to have love in her life. She wants to have love with her son. She wants her co-workers to understand her. But she's misunderstood in how she deals with people. She's not a bad person. And again, that's another reason I think I enjoyed playing her, was to find uh, the human qualities in her that we all have. The film is also about her complex relationship with her son, Adam, who's away in college and to whom she never showed any affection or care growing up. He's someone who's really been damaged by her. I think he's just someone looking for a little bit of acceptance and acknowledgement in what she's done to him. Jessica is this powerhouse. I feel like she's so important because she's such a contrast to Karen. The fact that she's young and beautiful, she's able to explore her sexuality without anything holding her back. She has this openness that Karen hides. It's such a dark piece of writing. And to be honest, I love composing dark music. So I thought, what better marriage? than the script to my music. I think it really pinpoints the fact that most people aren't as complex as you would think that they are. There really is sort of one defining thing about them that controls them and their actions and their lives.